So does your gastric sleeve stretch out with time? Three, two, one. Here we go. Hi, I'm Dr. Alvarez with endobariatric.com and today I will address this question that is quite common. Can you stretch out your sleeve or does your sleeve stretch out with time? Now, what we know is that some sleeve stretching is known to happen with time, especially with bigger or wider sleeves. But it is important to say that the sleeve will never, will never, ever stretch out to its original size the stomach had. Now, how much does a sleeve stretch out? The stretching of the sleeve has a direct relationship with how big that sleeve was made originally. Here is where the size of the bougie comes into place at the time of surgery. The bigger the bougie used for your surgery, the more likely it will have some stretching down the road. The lower the bougie size used for your surgery, the less likely you'll have some stretching down the road. Now, you might be asking yourself, what is a bougie? Well, a bougie is also a word for the calibration tube used to craft your sleeve. The wider that calibration used at the time of surgery, well, the wider your sleeve will be. Also important factors with sleeve stretching is the surgical technique used while doing your surgery or your sleeve. It is important that the surgeon at the time of surgery removes the fundus of the stomach. That precise part of the stomach is, uh, which is the fundus, is the most stretchy part of the whole stomach but it also carries a good amount of ghrelin. And the ghrelin hormone, which is also called the hunger hormone too, uh, of course, the less fundus, at the time of surgery, we remove the fundus, the less fundus, the less ghrelin, less hunger after surgery. If the fundus of the stomach is left behind at the time of surgery, you will have a tendency to stretch out your sleeve with time because that is the most stretchy part of the stomach and it's left behind. That is why it is, it is very important, it is crucial, it is super important to have this surgery done with someone who knows what he or she is doing and that you have a, an expert that focuses on this procedure to do your surgery. This will greatly increase the likelihood of a better outcome. A sleeve does not equal a sleeve because it is so dependent on the surgeon. It is artwork. It is crafted. Are you enjoying this video? If you can help me out with a like, I would greatly appreciate it. Thank you very much. And why not consider subscribing to this channel so you don't miss out on future videos. Now, Patients with sleeves will notice restriction is amazing the first few weeks after surgery. It doesn't stay that way. And this is mainly due to swollen tissue of the stomach and the surgery just being so recent. It is not your real capacity. As the swollen tissue starts to come down, as the days and weeks go by, the stomach will have more space to hold food. Now, this, of course, will still be a fraction of what you used to eat prior to surgery. Please understand this. Now, some people may compare the stretching of the sleeve with the stretching of a gastric bypass. But the cause of the ruin why gastric bypass is quite different. Both etiologies are totally different. Bypass patients who regain weight or stretch the pouch is quite different since the ruin y gastric bypass patients have an anastomosis or a connection uh, the stomach with the intestine 
that will distend along with time, along with the small intestine, that will enlarge in diameter, giving more capacity to the patient. Since the sleeve lacks all these issues, you will need to focus on healthier food choices and make the most out of your weight loss, especially those first 12 to 18 months. I hope this makes sense. What I'm trying to tell you is even though you have a nicely sleeve done, you may have weight regain if you don't watch what you eat, if you don't make wise decisions, if you grace, if you have a lot of liquid calories. So think twice on whatever you are about to eat. Makes sense, doesn't it? All right, so that is it for this question of the week. Uh, I'm Dr. Alvarez with endobariatric.com, where we are changing lives one sleeve at a time. Take care and God bless.